Hello, greetings, my friends. This is Gilles Mancillon. I saw that come and, um, and, and, and wish you a good day. I hope you, you, you are, you are full of energy today. Um, for, for, uh, the, I want to discuss a few ideas. The first one is the power of words. Words are very powerful. They are the essential tools for, for either creating joy, peace, uh, peace and, and, and freedom or to create chaos and confusion. So use your words very carefully for, um, you want to speak from the heart. Yeah, you, we activate through the fifth chakra. And uh, so we want to bring light and well-being with our words and to create unity. For there are many words, and many people that use words to create fear and separation. But we do not want for, for certain simple words can, can be very... Um, sorry about the phone. Um, can create... A, can, we can um, utilize our words to, to create... Uh, to, 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 to federate... Um, I, uh, to, to diffuse anger, to diffuse conflict. And so uh, for the fifth chakra, it's very powerful. Right? The voice is very powerful. It can be a tool for peace and it has to be used as a tool for peace. Um, yet continue to activate your heart chakra. It is a generator of love for it is disconnected to the great central sun. And, and it cre can, so, so, we, so we made a lot of progress in our feeling sides. And for a long time, we, we didn't want to feel too much because we felt like all kinds of shadows. But as we clean up and... and we can feel more and we can tune into the heart and eliminate from the heart anything that is not love. For, um, and, and to become the silent observer of the dark matrix and to, to take care of your... To, don't speak about other people's life. Try to speak about your own life. It is far more interesting. Um, I'm going to pull a few cards. For the heart is very important. The heart will be the judge of what is to come. So, oh, nice. For the past is the judgment. The judgment has a, everything's already been decided in truth. It is just the law of evolution wants every being and everything to do, be given time to make the choice to grow, to learn, and to evolve. So the law of evolution will continue. It is this end of time is just a change, a change of timeline, and the the end of selfishness, the end of corruption, the end of um, of iniquity. The end of lack, the end of suffering, the end of anger. So, so, uh, so those inner changes are unavoidable, and we seek to to create a world that is more in balance, and uh, all will be given um, in relationship to our action. Is so we for, for we we have these heartfelt um, words and, and actions, or, or, or heartless words and actions. So we want to forgive ourselves to learn the lessons that we. To everything what is done is done. We cannot change it. So, so we can only. Um, but but um, but it's very important to to seek to 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 think to to act to to think to speak and to act from the heart. For the heart will be the judge. Everything will be balanced out by the heart. What is heart? What is from the heart and what is outside of the heart? There is some good action that's heartless, and there is some some sometimes actions that are not really feel look so good, but come from the heart. So so it's really um, to to be outside of judgment. Where we are now is trust. Continue to trust, trust, trust uh, the one power that is you, the, this one creator power. And the future is generosity. We want to continue to be generous, for we want to take care of our own life, our own ascension, our own vibration. As we raise our vibration, we raise the whole frequency of the, the vibration of the whole planet and even the universe. Yet... Um, the tools that has been given to us is the service, the, the compassion, the love to be able to assist life and the world around us. That's the only tool we have in order to receive more. So, so we will take care of ourselves, yet we want to continue to be, to be attuned to what, um, to what we can do to assist the world in its uh, internal progress and evolution, to, be, to bring clarity, to bring lucidity, to bring wisdom, to bring, to bring peace into the, into the heart and mind of, um, of those we, we, we come in contact with. What we're working on now is wealth inner wealth and outer wealth to, to, to be abandoned for that is really uh, th there is there is uh, uh, poverty is completely foreign to divinity divinity is uh, by, by definition god possess all things uh, it is so so it is um this idea that uh, that that you have to be poor in order to be spiritual is like uh, this is like the controlling power that wants people to stay poor so that they can continue their power so it's about returning to to a sense of uh, of um, of empowerment and and um, and prosperity and abundance and what the, the result of that will be love for it is not about um for there are a lot of people that have a lot of material wealth that are very, very selfish. So it's not about being selfish. It's, it's just about being abundant and to be able to share. For, for all that we have is, is shared by the source, by the creator, and then we find a way to, to share it intelligently. So... Um, 
So the so this end time is, is really coming and it is unavoidable. It will bring a lot of equity for everybody needs to have the minimum of all they need and then given the opportunity to get more in the respect and, and, and balance of life. And so... Um, and all will be given in relationship to his or her action. Uh, everything is the, the what's done is done. We cannot change it. But, uh, but but what we do is really what will determine what the future, what our place within the future um, relationship to the the future Earth. And so uh, so. Um, so yeah, we have we can also reach beyond. Sometimes we can project our consciousness beyond the Earth. So just imagine you you go into orbit and you open your third eye. You can look at the Earth. It's beautiful from from such a beautiful jewel from in the, in the heavens. But they do she doesn't emit as much light as she will in the future. So you wanna you wanna ignite her as the, to bring all your light and love to her so that uh, this love and light from the core to the the surface and the atmosphere she can she can shine. And so you can go in your astral body uh, to to see to see the Earth from orbit. For it's like you separate yourself from the from all the madness that can be going on on the surface sometimes, and you find this silence and peace from up there. Or you can go into to the great ships, the, the can be Syrians, Arcturians, Pleiadians, or many ships that are invisible from the the third dimension. But uh, or you can go to the New Jerusalem, who's the flagship of the Federation, the, from the, commanded by. by the commander Ashtar and Lord Sananda. And so it's a huge ship. It's a beautiful. You go there and you will meet all kinds of extraterrestrials there. For everybody goes into those ships to make reports at night. But they're not allowed to, uh, to to bring back the information most of the time. But you can go there consciously, just make the contact. Everybody's invited. Also, wanted to talk about the laws of physics. They work very differently in third dimension, fourth dimension, fifth dimension, six, seven. Every time we climb into a new dimension, we have to relearn the laws of physics. For linear physics, Newtonian physics is like very third dimension. It's very useful to understand how life works in this 3D. But then when they discover fourth dimensional physics, quantum physics, there was such, such a discordance of, um, and then they, dis, they, they realized that there is no concordance between quantum physics and, and um, linear physics and quantum physics. But then when they look into cosmic physics, they, they see there's still no concordance, like the, 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 the central sun of the galaxy should attract everything, and should, should, the, the, the path of the, the, there is no logic in, in, in in linear physics, in relationship to cosmic physics, so so it's all it's all. So there was some scientists like Albert Einstein that was trying to find an equation that would that would um, that would um, uh, reconcile uh, quantum physics, linear physics, and cosmic physics. But in a sense, it's the, 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 they respond to different rules because they are on different level of dimension. So we, we're going to discover. Um, we have to discover that from our inner intuition and self, and 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 follow the path that's been. Um, and it's been dictated by our soul and spirit. And um, for, um, for the energy we receive from spirit, it's like, uh, it's very much, we do whatever we want with it. The more we are able, the more we go into light, the more we are able to receive and utilize. And it cannot be misused because all the dark beings, the vampires and so on, all the, the ones that works within the dark are not able to receive these higher energies. So we want to use it for, for inspiration, but the more we, the, the better we use, we use this energy, the more wisdom we, we, we can implement within our life in relationship to the energy we receive from spirit as inspiration, the more we are able to apply the information and the light that we receive, the more we will be able to receive as well. Um, and uh, it's important to, to be able to, when we have a busy schedule, we have a lot of things to do, it's to, to, um, to, to ask spirit to take care of small things for us to, to assist us with small things the big things is really it's much harder to for spirit to assist the big things will come as the all the small pieces come together so we want to take care of all the details and details are very very detail oriented it's important to to take care of that and uh, as spirit uh, takes charge of many little things for us that free us some time and um, and and then we'll, so we can stay more focused onto what's really important, what's um, which is what we want, what we seek to experience, and and, and our connection. Uh, for the highest wisdom is regeneration. There is a, there is a power of regeneration that comes from the sun. There is new photons, so we need to breathe in the light of the sun each and every day, and uh, and drink a lot of water. What we need to understand is the higher power. How do we work with those invisible force with more efficiency? How do, what can we delegate? What do we need to do ourselves? And, and to continue to, 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 to see the, the relationship, the one power that is both the, the unification of the conscious mind and, 
and uh, and and the invisible uh, the supreme intelligence that, uh, that 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 flows and 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 provides life for all and and so there are countless intelligence within the invisible world we have to tune in the more we the more we'll be able to ascend and and um, and tune in to the higher more subtle frequency of spirit the more our consciousness will be will be open and we'll be able to to utilize invisible resources for their and limited resources in the spirit realms what we need to do is nothing is like is better than your home to 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 find a, a situation where we feel good at home where we feel good in our physical body to envision this uh, the, the, this situation where we, uh, we here it's like this house is in the sky <laughs> it's like so it's it's uh, so it's, it's it's about continuing to envision this um, or to cultivate the, the well-being and of the to feel good within your body and, and our environment and the outcome is the message in the bottle to continue to follow the signs and the signs are, are given there is all kinds of synchronicity and signs so um so, uh, so so it is what i wanted to discuss today uh, for um, for we want to continue to to cultivate this energy we're still on the same direction the victory of the light has already been uh, been uh, been assured even before we even came into darkness the light knew that it was victorious it's just the middle scenario was not planned and so it's just a part of the the, the ins and outs of the working of the of the dynamic of duality that we, we're playing through this this scene but uh, uh, very soon we're going to find this uh, this joy this abundance this freedom and so we, we and we do want the, do we do want this for all of humanity for there are people in this world that are that have um, that have nothing that are really, are really uh, we, we want to eliminate poverty and we some people say well we don't we want to eliminate wealth because uh, they feel very jealous of those people that have it but it's not wealth that we want to eliminate it is poverty we want every Everybody to have all they need huh, for in the future all will be given to all huh, so that we can uh, we can share this world and uh, continue to evolve within our, our frequency so this um, and it is not just utopia it is it is part of the part of that which is um, plan for this planet and for humanity well i hope this message was interesting for you i thank you for liking sharing commenting and subscribing i'm going to sing a song it's a it's a it's a, it's a song um, of the cure it's, it's called just like heaven finish show me how you do that trick the one that makes me scream she said the one that makes me laugh she said and threw her arms around my neck show me how you do it and i promise you i promise that i'll run away with you i'll run away with you Spinning on that dizzy edge And I kissed her face Then I kissed her head And dream of all the different ways I had to make her glow Why are you so far away? She said Why don't you ever know That I'm in love with you That I'm in love with you you, soft and only you, lost and lonely you, strange as angels dancing in a deepest ocean, twisting in the water, you're just like a dream, you're just like a dream. Daylight licked me into shape. I must have been asleep for days and moving lips to breathe her name. I opened up my eyes and find myself alone, alone, alone above the raging sea that stole the only girl I loved and drowned her deep inside of me. You, soft and only you, lost and lonely you, just like Heaven. I'm going to pull one more card to finish this, uh, to conclude this, this communication. And the card of the day is the star. So it's like the star, the, the, the Archangel Jophiel. She, she's uh, she's, the, she's the, the bringer of the dream coming true. Huh? Follow your star. For we all have a star in the heaven. And first time we said, I am, a new star was born. And so uh, it says, uh, she says, the, the dream is becoming a reality. Believe in yourself. The end of a difficult situation. So we're really at the end of a cycle. Huh? We're really at the end of a cycle. 
and uh, and so this uh, so, so we'll be uh, we'll be pleased that we we stuck to the program for so long in the going through all those things that we've been to go through and so we're gonna now it is the time to 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 allow our dream to become real and and, uh, and and it is spirit that will bring it for the spirit wants to to hide it until it is the time for it to come so thank you very much wish you a wonderful day and i'll talk to you later namaste